So a lot of stuff has been going down among the uh, few things on the side. So I wanted to talk about this real quick because um, I've been getting tons of questions saying, hey, this refund thing, how does it work? What does it do? And what's happening with the refunds? What's happening with the bans? Am I going to get banned? What's happening here? Um, so I wanted to give you quick information on that um, and also just share some things with you so you at least know because people think the refund system is something way different than what the actual refund system is. So I wanted to explain that because people are new to gotcha games here um, and just explain some things that are going down. Again, I'm not covering the drama side of things, just the main refund thing um, and all of that. Um, still, I don't know what happened, but they haven't given a response yet still. I was hoping like in mail they say something um, or in some sort of announcement tab somewhere. That, like they said, this was our fix. Sorry for the thing. Like at least apologize to people, right? Still haven't. I, I don't get why, but I will maybe wait till Monday and see if they do it then because it's like, oh, they're back in office or something like that, even though they were already there. I don't get it. They haven't said anything. So I'm curious what happened there. But today, refunds, how that works and what happens with it. Um, that's, let's talk about it. If you're new to the channel, like you subscribe, helps out a ton. Let's hop over there. So first, to show you what's happening, I wanted to open up these things, right? So these are all the people trying to refund. They're talking about refunds over here on Reddit, um, and my comments also have been asking me about refunds, right? Now, basically what a refund is, this is what a refund is. You see this account over here? Um, this is one of the biggest whales, apparently, and they refunded. I believe, and I don't know if this is correct, right? So I already click this here. Someone does, like, say that it was um, a fat, quick $22,000 refunded, okay? Now... There is no shot that this person got all, if, if this person got 22,000 back, I am extremely shocked, right? But usually that is not the case. You get all the money back. You get majority back, yes, but not all of it. Now, how does the refund system work, okay? It's not a system that's supposed to be used all the time. Do not use this on gacha games all the time. It's a terrible idea because at a point they will ban your account completely and you can never use the app store or play store again with that email or something like that, okay? Don't use this as a system to abuse things, but if it's like a thing where you do not want to play this game anymore and you feel that they did scam you, you can request a refund either through Apple or Android. Now, if you do that, please understand if you have any semblance of like, I still want to play this game later on and you still want to use that account, you will lose the account. I don't know why people think it's not going to happen, but they really like, not just on Reddit, but in my comments and everything, they're like, oh, I can refund, get my money back, respend it, and boom, I just made double because they think like it's a great, a good thing or like that's what they can do. As soon as you refund, the second you ref uh, refund, even if it's like a dollar or two, you will get banned, okay? That's how that works, right? And now if you refund, okay, and you are on Apple versus Google Play, there is a high chance, there's a high chance on Apple, you will get the um, the block on the refund, right? For some reason, Apple doesn't allow it as much, Google Play does, but again, they don't always allow it, right? I try to refund everything and my requests were denied, Google Play Store, can anyone help me do it? I lost faith in the game and the devs, okay? This person and many other people have been trying to do it through Google Play, but because there's been such an influx in refunds, a lot of people are getting rejected, okay? So if you do try it and you don't get it to work, th uh, go through, that's it. It's not going to happen. You can try and process another request, but most likely it's not happening, okay? Now, again, the bans that are happening, you have to also keep in mind that, yes, an account like this will most likely get banned, but you, if you didn't refund, you won't get banned. People also have this, like, entire idea that they're randomly getting banned. Um, it's, it can't be that you're randomly getting banned unless you did something, but I haven't personally seen that anywhere. Uh, mainly, I've seen bans for people that have refunded. So if you refund, you will get banned. You'll lose your account. Um, if you want to refund and then restart the game, you're more than welcome to. Though, that is a very odd, uh, odd thing or awkward thing. Maybe you just want to refund because you are like regret spending money, and then you want to redo it free-to-play with no money spent and no support to the devs. You can do it that way. But again, I'm not giving you advice to do whatever you want. Just if you want to refund, go for it. Try it out. See if it works. Probably won't, but um, that's what's currently going down with that entire thing. The biggest of whales have refunded. Um, people in my guild, and this is like, usually I don't see it like so close to me, but people that I knew, <laughs> like I was cool with, and they, they refunded. I'm like, no freaking way. And the person that I talked to um, refunded about $100, and he got most of it back. Um, he lost like on two of the first purchases because it's like over the time period of when they can get back to you. Um, so basically, I think he got like 70-ish um, dollars back uh, overall, so it did happen. But again, if you are going to refund that's what's going to happen to you but yes if you're not refunding don't worry about it um you can continue playing everything will be fine they won't ban you uh or anything of the sort but that's currently where it stands again i understand everyone that's refunding they're not doing anything wrong you can't hate on them for it um in a way they did get scammed right i know people that summoned on the banner and there was no soft pity original knowledge on it right where you get it at 13 to 20 now someone really spent a hundred dollars to get it and after spending the hundred dollars he's like i only had to spend 20 really 
makes people furious, right? So you have to understand that like, if that knowledge was public, if they just made it as a pity at 20, and like they made that public knowledge, then everyone would have summoned him and fine. Like those in comparison to when they wouldn't have refunded, right? But because of everything, refunds occurred. So basically that's where it currently stands. I'm gonna get, you can see this, there's endless articles over here about what's happening um, and or other posts about what's happening. Again, people are getting denied now. So if you are going to try to do it, it might not work out and you might just risk your account for no reason. Um, so I do recommend to leave it um, cause like I know people that had a hundred dollars spent, but they refunded like 10, $20 only. And the other ones got rejected. They lost their account and they only got like 10 bucks back, right? So this is all the gamble you're taking by doing it. And again, I'm not saying any evidence against or for it. I'm just saying, if you do it, just know the risks. Okay. Though I understand you're doing it for, um, you know, what they've done, which is understandable. Just keep it in the back of your head. Okay. But yes, to run off the video again, I've been saying it. I still want to see a overall response, like a message from them. I'm um, saying something like anything, you know? And again, I'm still telling you that if they don't drop a message and they don't, they literally go and say like, just nothing, nothing. They, they keep quiet and they let their community managers give like bite-sized details of what they plan. Then I don't think they care about what you have to say. They were all like in the beginning, oh, we care about your community feedback. Um, and I just wanted to put a message out, right? Say, okay, we got it. You didn't like this one. We'll try and fix it for the future. We'll let you know what happens then. And we'll keep it where we'll give you the free Ken. We'll try our best to, you know, help you and, and let you know beforehand what events are going to look like. And we'll try our best to maintain a gem format where anyone can summon and have fun. That would be like a really cool message, though I am being on high copium to think that's what they're going to say. But still, they did kind of move promptly to give us one free Ken. But still, I, they did it. So I'm hoping, and again, this is me, the copium speaking. And again, I understand they still messed up. I wonder if they're going to do anything beyond that or if that's really all they got. Um, I am curious because I don't know. It's I'm shocked that they have been so radio silent for this much time. Like I'm still waiting. <laughs> it's, been, it's been a good amount of time with no uh, additional notice. And we've basically almost finished up the port port part where we get our free Ken. Uh, we're what two kills in. We're pushing our third one only at 70 percent. Damn. Damn, it's been taking a while. We were at 80 like a bunch of hours ago. Damn, okay. Uh, we, we're getting slow out here with this. Wow. I'm curious if it even drops a point percentage. It did. Okay, so we're good there. But it's been it's been slow then because I'm pretty sure we're at 80 pretty earlier in the day. Or maybe I'm maybe I'm tripping, but yeah. Um, I was hoping they said something but by, by now, but they still haven't. We're pushing like close to the end of the weekend. It's this dropped on like what Thursday, Friday. Now went through all of Saturday. Um, you're about to go through all of Sunday. By the time I upload this, you'll be on Sunday, right? So what happened? You waited Friday, Saturday, Sunday, no message. So at least give us some sort of clarity on what's happening. Uh, but again, if you are refunding, have fun. If you want to still stick with the game, I will try my best to cover content here. I'm waiting for the response so that I decide how I plan my content out because I want to, you know, move on to other things and start doing some other stuff. But I don't know if they're going to even give a response. I think they might just say, GG's boys. That was it, that free 10 uh, you have in the mail and just not say a word. That like that 10 is the way for players to understand that's what we did for you. Don't expect any more, you know what I mean? So, hoping that's not the case, but it could be, it could be. With that being said, catch you in the next one. Have one, stay safe, peace and enjoy. That's been it for me. Again, stay safe out there. If you are refunding, keep this in mind. When you are doing it, you may get banned. If you're not going to do it, you don't have to worry. Everything's gonna be fine for you. If you still wanna play the game, there is a lot to look forward to in future events. But if they become gem paywalled, where it's you can't use gems, you can use only other stuff, that is how you know this game has solidified the nail in the coffin. Um, my only thing, so if they do put out a good response, I'll be waiting till Akuma, and I'll see if they make him a gem event. Absolute W. If they don't, I'm packing up. I'm packing up a dipping. All right, that's my plan. So hopefully they don't screw that up. But yeah, catch you in the next one. Have a stay safe, peace, and enjoy. That's been it for me. Thank you for watching.